It's not about ego. It's not a one-size-fits-all. They just have a desire to try to make something interesting and have some impact on the world. It's really about problem solving. See things that other people haven't seen, envision things that other people haven't been able to envision before. I think the question is what is not affected by IT and computers these days. Computers are in everything. I mean, computers in your car, computers in your shoes. <laughs> I almost can't think of a business that doesn't have information technology as the linkage across all of the pieces of it. Innovation, design, development, products. It's uh, very fast-paced, detail-oriented. People have very different disciplines in which they excel. We test exciting new technologies. I feel like some type of secret agent, you know what I'm saying? We get to work on a lot of innovative, uh, forward-thinking projects. Microsoft Surface. TV shows. Flash and Shockwave games. And then you're really limited to how fast your cell phone can download stuff from the sky. I learn something new every single day. I have a job where I go in and I enjoy it, and I do it, and I make great money doing it. I think you'll see that need continue to grow for people that have a technology background. They don't need advanced degrees. They don't need years of experience. There's no barrier to keep you out. I mean, as long as you know computers, you can have a job anywhere.